to Laura Backstage, and I'm Victoria Kirby, bringing you the first look at the hair and makeup from Michael Kors Spring 2009. Well, the inspiration is to do very sleek graphic hair, um, and we do that by doing a ponytail. Um, we sleek the hair all back, wrap extensions around it to make it really full, and then we cut it sharp along the bottom. It's Michael's girl. He loves a tan girl, fresh, healthy stuff. Actually, we talked this season about Catherine Hepburn, which I thought was interesting because that kind of you know American iconic movie glamour. What we've done is like a little bit of bronzy and red mixed cream on the on the brow and the cheek, and I'm picking picking that up with a powder bronzer. And then we have a beautiful, strong red lip. So how do you do a red lip so that it, it, it looks elegant but not too kind of stiff and hard? The main thing is to respect your lip line. Don't draw over the lip line, don't try and get corrective, just like stick with what you've got, keep your face fresh, just be healthy as you possibly can and you know, and be comfortable with it. Since I've been in business, we have, I think, done a red lip once before. Um, we had some great pictures of Katherine Hepburn in the 50s where she had no makeup on at all. She had just come back from the beach and she just had red lipstick. So I kind of love the idea that in the summer you would get off the beach and just pop on your red lip. I love how graphic it is, it's feminine. Um, and then what is everyone's dream hair? Well, shiny, 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 shiny in a convertible and blowing. So it's really all about you know that sleek head of hair, the ponytail that blows, perfect you know, the horse's tail that you dream you have.